purpose of this video is to make you and your child feel very welcome on both the familiarisation days and on the test days at Grosvenor Grammar School. We want to really set out the system that we have in place and hopefully make you feel a little bit more comfortable when you arrive either next week or on the days of the IQ examinations. So hopefully you will find this informative and useful and it will help you get prepared for what lies ahead. As you can see from the aerial footage, we have plenty of car parking spaces, so you can park either in the visitor's car park, which is to my left currently, or in the main car park, which you'll see again from the aerial photos. As soon as you come into the car park, probably the main entrance you'll come through is at this gateway to the side of the school. And what you're doing then is you can accompany your child right up to the front of the school, and we're going to take you across and show you the cone layout that we have with a safe area for your child to be able to enter. Once you get to the front entrance of the school, you'll see there's a coned off area here, which is an orange, and again, that's a safe area for your child. So if you just drop them off here, outside the natural coned area, and let them go on into school, and as soon as they get in there, there'll be lots of people ready to greet them and to help them, so don't worry. On the day your child will come into the front entrance of the school, there will be lots of people on hand to help him or her. First thing we'll be asking the children to do is to pop into the hand washing stations which are on the left hand side as soon as they come into the front entrance. Now there are six stations all together so we are hoping that the queues will go down very quickly but as I said to you in the email if it happens to be a cold day, if the weather is bad, what we will do is bring the children in as quickly as possible to get them settled and we'll take them into our main assembly hall which again we've set up in terms of social distancing to keep them safe and keep them warm. So welcome to our main assembly hall inside the school building. As you can see, it's a, a huge area. It's a lovely big space for us to use. And this is really our standby area, which is to the right hand side as the children come in through the front door. And what we're imagining is it's going to be cold on those afternoons and on those mornings, or it might be wet. So this is the area in which we will gather the children socially distanced, because you can see the cones that we've already laid out, and this will help them. It's a lovely big room. Uh, and we will be able to cope with the large numbers coming in but obviously we're going to stagger your arrival times as well which will also help ease the situation. You can see from the size of this room why we were very particular about still sticking to the idea of using the classrooms in Grosvenor Grammar School rather than this main assembly hall because we didn't want it to be imposing to the children but when they first come in and they're all socially distanced and they're moving up to their rooms afterwards I think they will really appreciate the space and they will be able to see their friends possibly from other primary schools or their own primary school and it will make them feel again very welcome. So once your child comes out of the hand washing station what will happen is that the prefects will be gathered here and your child can just show them the card and tell them the room number. We'll have the list as well just in case your child forgets it's absolutely fine and the prefects will then accompany the children up to the room. Uh, and make sure that they're well settled and ready to go. When your child is leaving the school, either on familiarisation day or on the mornings of the test, they'll come out into this coned off area again, just at the front entrance. So the first thing that they will see and be told about is this green area set up with cones and we're going to bring them out one room at a time. We'll give you the order of the room exits on the day and also at the same time, we're going to put that on our Twitter feed. So hopefully you will be able to come from your car and come out and know when your child will be coming out. So they will line up in a nice row, just in this safe green area here, marked out by the cones. And then you'll be able hopefully to see them quite clearly. We keep this area free, again, of any adults. And we'll ask you to stay. 
stay beyond the blue cold area at the front. So children will be able to come forward, they'll be able to find mum and dad quite easily and hopefully then with the numbers that we have it'll be simpler and easier for you to exit the school in a way that's a bit more controllable. Thank you very much for your attention regarding this video. We hope that you've found it useful. If there's anything else that you're unsure of, if you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to email or to telephone the school. We are here to help. And what I would like to say again is we wish your children all the very best for the tests ahead. And we look forward to seeing them next week. Thank you.